Our first guest today is a singer and belly dancer who combined her love for Middle Eastern and experimental electronic music with modern club music to form a truly unique sound, introducing Cora Camille of the band Final Veil. Hi. Hi, how are you? I'm good, how are you doing? Good, thank you so much for being here and thank bringing you your, your talents and your gifts here. You have some very interesting um, talents and gifts in your background is pretty interesting. Tell us oh, about you. Um, how you started in, in this I type started of music. belly dancing a really long time ago and my mom and my grandmother had belly danced wow. and when I was a teenager my mom gave me her old Egyptian records and I fell in love with the music. I fell in love with the dance. Um, I went when I went to college that's what I did to make all my extra money in college is teach belly dancing. I've been teaching it for a long time. And uh, several years ago, I decided to kind of meld my interest in dance with doing music. Mm -hmm. And I tried a lot of different, I tried different instruments, tried the guitar for, the, for a while, tried the oud, which is like an Egyptian version of a guitar, mm -hmm. um, and settled really into singing and writing music mm -hmm. um, and writing electronic music and working with a band. So how is electronic music kind of different? How, how is it experimental? It's actually really exciting as a composer because mm -hmm. I can hear like a whole song in my head and have all these different layers um, where each one we can create it just how I heard it in my head. Wow. Um, you know, we can have a whole, you know, orchestra, bass line, all the different things. And we have live instrumentation too that goes with it. So uh, I have a three piece band. Mm -hmm. um, uh, Christian Anken and uh, Rick Costa are with me too, and we are really proud of this new album that we just. Uh, so, what put are out. the instruments in your in your three piece band? So I sing and then dance mm -hmm. and uh, write some of the electronic parts, and then Christian plays electric guitar and then DJs the electronic parts, and then Rick uh, plays all different kinds of Middle Eastern percussion mm -hmm. live. So now you dance and sing. Is yes. that at the same time? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> How do you do that? <laughs> uh, a lot of breath control and practice. Because <laughs> it's, uh, it's, it's a real, um, I guess, art to do the belly dancing part yeah. of it and then to... How do you think, I think about it, the singing and the belly dancing at the same time? Yeah, I think it helps that I've done the dance for a long time. Mm -hmm. um, and it actually is is soothing to me because belly dancing, kind of the moves of it are just, they're relaxing to me and very familiar and mm -hmm. it fits with the music. So um, the music that we're writing is a mix of Middle Eastern belly dance music with like club music and mm -hmm. club beats. So it's a mix of East and West. And so the, the Middle Eastern parts of it are really easy for me to move with. Mm -hmm. And um, and actually the the club beats are something, I, you know, I like to go out dancing to that too. So yeah. it, it feels really natural to put it together because it's something I already like to do. So now when you yeah. started to belly dance, does your mother and grandmother know? that you know that was going to be a passion of yours because I guess it's a long line I of know belly my, dancing. yeah my mom was really proud of me I wish mm -hmm. my grandma could see what yeah. I was doing now she's passed away but um, I don't know if they they neither one of them wanted to perform it really mm -hmm. so it was for because it's a great form of exercise mm -hmm. and it's almost um, it's almost got a spiritual component to it mm -hmm. as well in terms of uh, for your the way that you think and you know gives you a lot of self-esteem and um, great it's just great for people to try it's a really artistic release right. it's really wonderful and you've taught a lot around the city i was i was telling you i think i've taught i've taken one of your classes yeah, yeah. before <laughs> so you see you teach as well mm -hmm. so mm -hmm. um very cool talk to us about the album what what's the lyric base of the album so well it's original music now we do a couple of uh egyptian covers mm -hmm. so but we definitely turn them on their heads so people uh, only belly dancers would probably even recognize those. Um, but it's mostly, I mostly sing in English, but I also sing in Arabic mm -hmm. as well. And uh, we have Middle Eastern percussion, and we mix that uh, with electronic beats. We've, um, on this album, we've been doing some dubstep, mm -hmm. uh, very cool. drum That's and very bass. Very right now. Yeah, drum and bass, uh, and trip hop, and down tempo, and like we're gonna all talk, those different we things. We got a lot, we got, yeah. we're gonna talk about that as soon as we get back, guys. You don't wanna go anywhere. We'll be back with more Cora after the break. Stay tuned. <laughs> 